Today we're helping Heaven place her boyfriend Keenan to an epic loyalty test. I really just need to see if my nigga cheating because he just always want to be on these bikes. He always around his friends. So I'm just trying to see what he really capable of. Is he loyal or do he be playing in my face? What's up? Go. Did your car decline? Yes. Do you have any money? Um. If I told you I had a way to, that you can make seven hundred fifty dollars easy, would you be interested? Yes. Follow me. Come on. Uh, I'll be right back. This is honestly the easiest seven hundred fifty dollars you can possibly make by clicking the link in the description or simply scanning my QR code. First, you will have to answer a few survey questions followed by optional offers. Then you will get the option to complete deals to claim your award. Depending on how many deals you complete will determine how much money you will earn. For instance, if you complete five deals, you can earn a hundred dollars. If you complete ten, you will earn two hundred and fifty dollars. And if you complete twenty deals, you will earn seven hundred and fifty dollars by simply downloading apps. Seven hundred and fifty dollars. Nice doing business with you. Next time when you go inside of a store, okay. have some money on your cash app, you feel me? Because that's not a good look, okay? I think my car was just locked, but thank you for the 750. All right, once again, you guys, if you want to get an easy $750, man, download 20 deals. Make sure you click the link in my description. Back to the video. Keenan spent so much time on his bike in that bike rally that his girlfriend, Heaven, is starting to feel very much neglected. On top of that, Heaven's best friend claims that she saw Keenan on his bike with a girl on the back. Not to mention my homegirl said that she saw him on that bike. You actually saw his face? Yes, I seen his whole face, and I be with him all the time, so I knew that was him. So did you ask him about it? I always ask him about it. He always tell me, oh, it's not that serious. We just be chilling. This is what me and the boys do, so. I'm just tired of hearing the same thing. I'm just tired. Okay, outside from her saying that she saw him on a bike, have you had any like other run-ins to where you felt like he was being disloyal to you? <sighs> Not to embarrass myself or anything, but we don't even be fucking no more. Like, so I'm not gonna lie, that be making me feel some kind of way. Wait, 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 um, so basically y'all don't have mm -hmm. sex no more at all? No, like at all. He don't even want to cuddle every time Did I Did y'all used to, to always him. have sex? Yes, we used to have sex very often. Every time I want to fuck, he be ready. But now he just, he just not with it. He not feeling me no more. Kenan is no longer fulfilling heaven's sexual needs, causing her to think that he's being disloyal. Ironically, he's been doing nothing with his time but riding that bike when this whole entire time, heaven's been trying to ride him. For those of you who don't know, if you're part of the bike community, brotherhood is very strong and anybody is down to ride at any given time. So we wanted to use that to our advantage and attempt to lure Kenan and potentially start phase one of this test. So we got Kenan Instagram from heaven and Gabe reached out to him to see if he was down to ride. Hey, did Kenan ever respond to you? What time did he say he was gonna ride? Uh, I ain't really give him no time, so I said, I just told him, I was like, hey, you ride? He's like, yeah, so I said, all right, I'm gonna get the guys together. Guys gotta ride tomorrow. And then, shoot me your number, then I'm gonna see the time. He's like, all right, bet. All right, say less. Come out of the booth, come out of the booth. All right, bet, bet, see him, see him, see him. Yeah, I see him. Yeah, I see him, I see him right there. Yeah, I see him, I see him. 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 Yo! What's up, bro? Hey, you pulled up, huh? I ain't think he's gonna pull up, bro. Yeah, what's up, man? Meet the guys, bro. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Was it traffic? Ooh. Yo, hey, it's my boy right here, man. You know what I'm saying? It's my friend, yeah. Yes, sir. Phase one is simple, but the most important part of this test, and here's why. Barbara will be playing a decoy, and her job is to simply get his social media or a phone number so she can further discuss things with him outside of this ride. Her getting his number is very detrimental to the test because if she fails today, we will have to scratch her as a decoy and start this whole phase one over again. And who's to say we're actually able to lure Keenan a second time? We needed this to feel real, so I invited some of my closest biker friends to do an actual ride after Barbara attempts to get his number. Man, what's the, where the bike at, bro? Uh -huh. Come on, bro, where the bike is? Y'all didn't even hit me up. Huh? Y'all didn't hit me up. Oh, man, I thought he was bringing the bike, dog. By the time I got the text that I was out here, I yeah. was already in the car. Oh, for real? Bro, you're fake. Oh, you're man. fake, you're fake. All of y'all is fake. <laughs> All y'all fake. Wait, who this? That's oh, my, my brother, brother, bro. I can do that. Hey, bro. Oh, well, who are you? Kino? You're my boy Kino, man. Oh, okay, which bike yeah. is yours? Wait, which one is yours? This one? Which one that looks like I ride? 
You probably got the best bike out here. Mm. Oh, ah, you know he ain't got a big bike out here. Maybe this one? Yeah. This one? How long you been riding? I do, I do. <laughs> How long you been riding? <laughs> oh, this is a Suzuki? I ain't gonna lie, for a good three years now, but I tell everything I know to myself. Really? Oh, okay. We gotta ride sometime. You got. Don't ride bikes. Bro, don't I ride bikes? Bike. I'm yeah, serious. Well, well, she got a bike, but she got a bike. Nah, she ride bikes, bro. All right, I mean, that shit hard too, though. I know, you yeah. see. Hey, we low key all matching. So. Yeah, no fool. Bro, not for real. I really ride. I think we should, like, link or something like that. Yeah. I mean, we we ride all the time. Race. Race type shit. You so much you ride, we racing. I mean, I got some speed. What you got? I got what some kind of experience. Bike you you gotta ride with me to see it. She got some shit though. It's her shit. It's her shit. It's her shit, bro. Yeah. Should have brought a bike, bro. Y'all, you text me way too late. Thank you. She big money. No, but for real. You know what you're doing. This either though. She probably is. I'll let you take it for a spin. This link. Nah, I do. I ride the speed limit, you know. Right. I try to stay out of trouble. So you a speed demon? That's what you say you is. Yeah. So what y'all finna do right now? Man, we finna uh, we finna go on the ride, man. Little ride, what they saying about we always take a bit. Well, we all on the bikes. Let me tell you this, like. You gotta keep up. Nah, I'm probably not gonna go with y'all today, but like we should really like exchange either. You got social media? You got yeah, Instagram yeah. or something? Yeah, I got social media. All right, we can exchange Instagram and then we can probably link for a ride or something like that. Yeah. That's cool? Yeah, All right. No, no stand a nigga up now. Nah. Yeah. standing you She cool. She cool people. That's your people, that's my people. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That's our TJ. Y'all ready or what, man? 713. Yeah, go right there. All right, make sure you follow me back, bro. For sure. I'm serious. And stop being fake. Dino, Damn. be safe. Barbara successfully got Keenan an Instagram, but like I said before, bike community is very friendly, and Keenan giving Barbara his Instagram means absolutely nothing. After Barbara retrieved his Instagram and had a genuine conversation with Keenan, her work here was done. The guys ended up going on that ride, and phase one was finally complete. We wanted to wait a few days before messaging Keenan, so we did just that. But after finally sliding into the DM a few days later, this is how that conversation went. Barbara reached out to Keenan and said, Hey, what you got going on today? He said, Nothing, just chilling. She then responded, You not riding today? He said, I didn't plan on it, but if you're riding, then we can do that. Barbara then responded, It's low key hot as fuck. I'm thinking we can grab some food or chill at my place. It's up to you. Leaving everything up to him. He then responded, I can slide. What side of town you on? Barbara said, I'll see you my location. What's your number? To make a long story short, Barbara ended up inviting Keenan to the crib later on that night, and he accepted. Giving us enough time to go in, place our cameras to catch his true intentions. So when Kenan arrived, most of the loyalty tests will take place right here, but we'll be watching upstairs from a room in a command center. Barbara, will be playing a decoy for today's loyalty test? Hey, Barbara. Hello. So this is Heaven, Barb, Barb, Barb. Heaven, or whatever. Do you got anything you want to ask her or do's and don'ts that you, you don't want her to do? Um, I really just want you to go off for it because I'm really just trying to see if my nigga loyal to me or not. So do what you do and we okay. go see how he how he play it. Okay. 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 So friends, she's sitting in on it too? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's cool. All right, Wait, so what's we. What's your name? I'm Ray. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So Barbara's gonna give Keenan a call real quick just to see if he's still coming. Okay. <laughs> Damn, you stood a nigga up. No offense. The person you were trying to reach has a voicemail box that has Okay. Not Maybe he. You talked to him today, right? Yeah. Either two things right now. Keenan is extremely busy and he cannot get to his phone, or he flaking on Barbara right now. Call back. We not gonna blow his phone up. We gonna call him one more time. Let it ring all the way through. If he does not answer, then maybe he had no intentions on actually coming over here. Mm. Maybe he not gonna come. Hey, hello. Hello. Hey, where you where you at? I thought you said you was gonna meet me so we can go get some food. You still wanna do that? Yeah, we can still do that. Okay, so how far are you away from the location that I sent? Uh, cause I'm already started heading that way type shit, so I'm like fifteen minutes. 
Tell me okay. just gonna chill at the crib. Okay, that's cool. We could just chill at my shit. That's cool too? Yeah. All right, babe, I'm gonna slide. All right, see you soon. I didn't tell your ass this nigga ain't shit. Girl, I just, I just can't. So how do you feel hearing the phone call? Irritated because we not even fucking like I was told you before. We not even cuddling. He don't want to kiss on me. And then another girl called him and he got the nerve to say he about to come over here. I just feel like he on some bullshit. And I was hoping that he wasn't, you feel me, go he fuck around. Answer. But clearly he yeah. trying to come to a bitch house. What are what are you trying to do? Like, I'm confused. I don't fuck with okay. that. So we're going to go upstairs. We're going to go to the command center. We can listen in on everything that they're saying. And we're going to see how everything play out. Whenever you're ready to come down in the front, we can go ahead and do that. So Ken obviously ended up answering the phone. He agreed to come over to the crib. Everything is set. We're about to go upstairs and watch everything from the command center. And Heaven Eyes, she already said that he failed this test. So I guess we're here to see how everything plays out. Hugger and I. How long was the drive? Well, it's hot outside, huh? We can sit over here. Don't be scratching up my flows now. Thank you. I was gonna order something. Are you hungry? You can sit in the Um, what you in the mood for? I mean, I had a little something, but I can eat. I can eat again though. What you ate earlier? I had Chick-fil-A. Okay. Um, I know. It's Houston. Where Where are you from? I'm from Houston. Okay. We're from where though. From? I'm from Houston. What do you do? Cause Why are you in my business? It's tough though. What do you do? Man, don't worry about that. You ain't telling me what you do. You, you could be in the CIA for all I know. Uh, I'm into a lot. I do hair. Honestly. Yeah. yeah. So hair get you this? I need to do hair. Yeah, you do. I know. Okay, so what you finna order? What we finna order? What we finna eat? Talk this up to you. I'm gonna let you be the boss. Okay. You the one with all this. I'm following your lead. Okay. So when we going on a ride? Where is your bike at? It's you in the see, garage. You, let me see. No, cause you're not answering my questions. I think you scared to race. That's I'm not. Means. Really, I'm not ankle kind of injured. I injured my ankle from riding. Uh, like I thought I was going. No, I can't. So I just been taking a hiatus to you know heal. You thirsty? See what you got to drink. I got some. I think I got some water and stuff. I need to go grocery shopping. Maybe liquor. some liquor. liquor. You know, liquor give you courage. Come on, get some drink. Man, what, you what you mean? What I'm on? You you came over here. What you on? Uh, Let's start off slight. You like clear liquor? You don't fuck with clear? Fuck no. Clear, clear how you doing things. So, let me ask you a question. What? You said you single and you successful and whatnot. Why are you single and whatnot? Because niggas you? aren't. You can have whoever you want type shit. Because niggas aren't. I can have you too, huh? I ain't gonna say that. So, why you came I mean, up here? I, here? I fuck with you, you. You cute. You don't even know me like that. How else you get to know somebody? That's true. You made me some water. Like, I want some real drink. Uh. You ain't got no liquor? Let me see what's in here. <laughs> I didn't know you was being serious. I mean, you supposed to be getting food. That's what I'm saying. You want to you wanna drink on a, oh, a uh, empty uh, stomach? She got some. You want some shots? It's all right. Okay, come on. Let's. All right, let's take a shot. Let's open it. You got to bless the bottle. You know how, like, people bless the bottle before they open it? I'm for sure bless the bottle. You could bless them. Nah, I'm just waiting to be chill out. Yeah, you could do it. I'm gonna get some glasses. You said it look like what? This is a lock seal tight. I got something else in there. Let me see. Now, when you get drunk, what's gonna happen? I got the blue bottle. What kind of, what kind of liquor are you? Well, I really don't like clear because it make you go crazy and stuff. 
So you, crazy. you see why it's, so, it's still in here. You're a lightweight. Very much so. Here. You, you gonna take a shot? What, what you, how you, how you gonna lift Um, you wanna see? You wanna see how I get? I told you I get a little courageous. You took one? You babysitting. I just took a shot on me. Do it another one. You ain't come over here for nothing. Well, what you saying? I'm just saying. Why did you come over here? Take your shot first. Okay, big boy. You wanna take the bottle over there? Wanna play 21 questions? I'm gonna take this water. I don't need it. Let's play 21 questions. Let's get to know each other. Let's get acquainted. So how long have you been riding bikes? Um, well, why do you want to talk about that? When you get liquor involved, you, I mean, boring. You know, Most girls that I know, they don't really ride bikes like that. Like, they be scared to get on bikes. And you, you wild. Like, it <laughs> make, it, it's lit, huh? You want to ask some questions? Oh yeah, we can play 21 questions. So, oh, how is it going to work? So, every, every question you don't want to answer, you're going to take a shot? Okay. That's cool. Um, you're going to get drunk then. How many bodies you got? Go ahead. Go ahead. Hang on. You in a hot seat. Okay. Hey, good job. You want to ask me something? So, like, what's something about you that nobody knows? That nobody knows? Yeah. Not a lot of people know? Like, nobody knows. Um, okay. Um, that nobody knows. Mm. Be real too. I think, um, so I look like I'm like innocent and stuff, yeah. but I'm really not. Like, I'm you really, so I'm a Gemini. Mm. Dang, who keep calling you? My brother, like he, he, bro, that nigga always asking You think it's, he shit. keep calling, so you should probably answer. It's probably an emergency. So I'm his brother. Why he don't want to say it's his bitch? Yeah, but what if he, it's an emergency and he needs some money because he got a flat, need a tire? I can talk to him whenever, that's cool. Okay, okay, let me ask you this. Back to the question. I already answered it. I'm not as innocent as I look. You want to know something about me? Yeah. Um, I was a licensed masseuse, but nobody know that shit. Okay, so you do it with your hands. Like, what? Oh, no, no. Like, a licensed masseuse? Okay. He don't got no license. Oh, you can do my back. Yeah, you like it. Oh, you ain't you, you ain't got, got no oil. oil. That's why I'm even gonna say, like, you, you the masseuse, you're supposed to act like with the Ciroc yeah, bottle, too. No, we're not gonna do that. Okay, let's do. Oh, you want me to lay down? Okay, here, hold this. How you want me to lay down? Like, you want me to? Well, you supposed to take your shot. You tell me something about you. Oh no, I answered my question though. So like, how you, you want me to do this? No because this is my crib. We're trying to get you drunk. Yes, I'm trying to get you out your. You don't I'm chill. Very much so. You want me to lay down? Like, what you want me to do? If he lay this bitch down, down and start, start rubbing her back. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Nah. Like, all right. So you gonna lay across here, and then okay. You gotta tell me like. Okay. Like, you gonna lay here, and then you gonna take this shit off. You been supposed to be out the clothes. So like, where you be having tension? Um, uh, really, my whole back. Oh, you didn't give your your ex girlfriend massages and stuff. She would have stayed if you was a masseuse. What the fuck is you doing? What the fuck is you doing? You at a whole bitch house? Where's your phone? Where's your phone? Where's your phone? I've been calling you. I thought you was with your brothers. I thought you was with your brothers. I thought you was with your brothers. What the? And you been single? You been single for how long? You been telling this bitch you're single? What? No innocent shit, nigga. Acting like you just been. I thought you was with your brothers. I thought you was with your brothers, nigga. You asking the bitch what she do for a living? Where the fuck is your crib? Where the fuck is your crib? Where is your shit at? Where is your shit at? You don't have shit. You're a mom and you up here trying to cuddle with a bitch. That's cap. Who is you? Like what the fuck is going on? The whole entire time you've been on a loyalty test. The day you met the decoy barber, she wasn't really fucking with you at all, bro. You've been on a loyalty test the whole entire time. So your girlfriend set you up because she. she... Fucking me for real. Boy, get the fuck out of here. Boy, get the fuck out of here. You in the whole bitch house talking about what? You in the whole bitch house talking about what? Why the fuck is you in the bitch house? Because what the fuck is you doing? What the fuck is you doing? Y'all get my face. No, but you, you, you wasn't, you wasn't scared. You only mad because you getting caught. But you was, but you was on that. No, you was, you was on that when you was in here by yourself, and you a licensed masseuse, right? When you right. get your license, 
Shit, when you get your license, you don't have no money. License for what? You and this bitch drinking so rock this cheap ass liquor. Is you serious? That's get the fuck shit. out. Get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. You need to go. You so fucking lame. And where the fuck is your? Shit lined up, nigga. Get the fuck. I got some other shit lined up. Why you tripping? Gotta have a backup. Boy, fuck you. Gotta have a backup. Fuck you. Don't come back to her shit. You're you're lame as fuck. On this lame ass bike, you wish your brother if you're lame. What the fuck is this? Wait, get the fuck this lame ass bike, nigga. I will literally hey, break your shit. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. So get the fuck home. Watch out. I don't give a fuck. Hey, watch out with this shit. Hey, I'll break everything it, you got. I'm trying to dip. I don't fuck with you. Shit. Shit. You're weird, nigga. No, you're weird. You over here trying to fuck with a bitch. You're not single. Hey, watch out. Let him go. It's good. Let him go. Let him go. Let him go. It's good. Don't worry about it. Boy, you're you're the lamest nigga ever. Bye, you're weird. And that's why you don't got no bitches. Nobody wants you. You out here begging, literally. You out here begging at a whole bitch house. Bye. And, they, and I bet you still won't have no bitch. You're lame. You ain't getting no pussy, clearly. None. You're lame. You're lame. You're lame. Get the fuck out. Why the fuck are you still in the driveway? How the fuck are you? You got a thousand dollar helmet, no money, no house. What? No money? Who told you that shit? Where's your money? Who told you that cap ass shit, bro? You asking this bitch to buy you food. You asking her where the money at. You asking this bitch to buy you food. You don't have no money. You don't have no money. Why are you still in the driveway? Nigga, I'm trying to do. As you can see. You not, you not going You're back. still here. You're still here. I ain't got no money. Ask everybody on the fucking. Nobody know. Nobody know. Get the fuck out of here. Bye. Lame ass niggas. Not in your lane. Not in your lane. Bye. You have nothing. Okay. Go ahead. Girl, bye fuck bye. this nigga. Fuck this nigga. Niggas is. Nigga, on that broke ass bike. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. Like I said in my previous video, for the person who passes the next loyalty test, I will reward them a thousand dollars. Thanks to Keenan, that thousand dollars just turned into two thousand dollars because he failed, obviously. See you guys in the next loyalty test, man. And until next time, jack off. <laughs> I ain't going nowhere. I love y'all, man. You feel me? Not nah, real talk. I'm gonna go.